Well, it looks like we're headed out of town for a few days. We're gonna go chase the snow a little bit and just explore some new areas. Been in Ravi all winter long now, so it'll be great to get out and uh, hit some new spots, places I've never been before. We're headed out with Dawson, Grayson, and Dylan, and where we're headed is under a snowfall warning. I mean, Revy might be too, but that's besides the point. Pretty stoked to get down there and uh, see what we're looking at. All right, getting ready to head over for day one here. And uh, you see I'm wearing a sweater and sweatpants because I forgot my base layers. Gotta love traveling to ride. Well, the good news is it is freaking pouring here this morning and I think it did all night long. So, we should find some snow up there. All right, guys, I forgot my GoPro batteries today, so we got this one battery to get us through the day, that's it. Yeah, we're headed up with Dylan, Grayson, Dawson, and the president of the Snowmobile Club here. It's funny how the trail system works here, or the grooming. It's almost like the honor system. There's just a box where you put your money into, and there's nobody here. Well, we're like 4K up now. The rain has switched to snow. Got like three, four inches on the trail here. And we still have a lot of elevation to climb. 6K up now, and it's starting to look pretty deep on the trail. It's uh, coming over the ski tips. All right, we're off the trail now, and we're into it. The snow's looking really good through here. So when I woke up this morning, I of course had a look at the the webcam in Revelstoke at the ski hill, and you know it looked pretty good. There was probably eight inches, six inches, and I was like, oh man, did we make make a poor call coming here? But there's definitely more snow here, more fresh, and this is super cool terrain through here. All these little pillows. Nice dry pal. I got my jerry can on the back, stacked on top of my Milwaukee pack out today. And it makes the sled feel very top heavy, like tippy. Some deeper snow. It's a weird feeling today just driving kind of blind not knowing where I am at all. Oh that's cool. Yeah, we'll hit this up again. 
Yeah. Because <laughs> we're not waiting. Give her. <laughs> So much wheelie with my uh, limiter strap long and the jerry can on the back. I feel like I smell someone's belt. Uh oh, I can't see. Not to make any uh, Polaris jokes here today, but uh, we're headed back down to look for a Polaris here. Maybe having some issues. What's going on there, Grayson? It's not very long. You shut that off. camera off right now. It's not on, I swear. <laughs> <laughs> major issues there just uh, doing some tuning headlight deep Clutch adjustment here, we're over revving a lot, so clicker down to clicker, maybe clicker one even. I'm still hitting the 8200 with my clickers on one. Spike in the 8200 more consistently, like 79 now. Which seems really weird because I was revving perfectly the last day I was out. Even still 83 at times, really? Alright guys, we're trying out Dylan's 165 boost here. This is, I think, a pro, so no ski lift. Mine is uh, limber strap on short at the moment, so lots of ski lift. It's been a minute since I've been on a player, so I forgot how to do it. Really get that uh, powder bog when the exhaust side is down. loud the boost turbo is. That blow off valve. <laughs> that power bog on the exhaust side though. Man, I hate that. <laughs> Woo. 
It works good, eh? Dude, I'm getting, I'm going fast up. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> I feel I can pick up speed way faster on this. Maybe it's the track. Maybe it's a mixture of the power and the track. Chase Dawson around on his 165 Chaos boost for a minute here. Try to, I guess I should say. Get roosted to shit. <sighs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Looks like there's been some, uh, Heavy activity in here already today. <laughs> right through the trees. Look at that. We're putting the GoPro away here for a bit so it can charge up, and we're just gonna ride. <laughs> <laughs> Those things don't power for the power block I'm fine. Good. Nine out of ten. Dude, I don't know how you do it with that hair. <coughs> that is wild. <laughs> Alright, GoPro's charged up. We're dropping our Jerry's here. And uh going on to our next kind of play area. <laughs> That was close. That stump just bumped me sideways. Sometimes it's tough not being out in the front having guys follow you. Because I'm trying to take my own fresh lines but also keep their lines in sight. So then I can just keep ripping but also get some fresh tracks up here. That was dumb. <laughs> I thought I was gonna be able to turn out on the backside of these trees, but it's just too much of a wall right there. Surprised I just couldn't keep climbing. Now this is a crappie stuck. Can't roll it. Guess I gotta pull it backwards. I got my slug kind of leveled out and then just went back and forth, created a bit of a bench here. Now I'll back into it and just Okay, we'll whip around. Look at 
that? We even got a cabin up here. Should have put my lunch in down below, but should be able to cook pretty quick though. Oh, what side is the toppings and what side is the crust? Ow. Cook for five minutes, should be perfect. Let's check it out. Uh, speakers, get some tunes going, got the lights, scoop shovels, barbecue. I guess it's probably locked. Nope. Sweet. Wicked. Oh yeah. Got the tunes going. This cabin is super well kept. It's cool to see. You're last. <laughs> I've already down stuck down there. <laughs> what's uh, what's lunch? <laughs> Swedish berries. I don't know. What I'm <laughs> All right. It's been like five minutes. Lunch should be cooked. <laughs> That's the first wildlife I've seen in the mountain in a long time. Hey, trophies. I don't have a lighter, no. Dude, he's totally trying to get in here. Yeah, go use it. There's, the lighter might start. Got everything up here. Still seems uh, super early in the day, but I think we're pretty much headed out now. All the players are out of fuel. Ah. I can't seem to ride. Whew. It's getting deeper. Unfortunately, I don't think I can have much uh, video for you guys other than GoPro footage today. <laughs> just haven't had the opportunity to film the guys really. We're just <laughs> burning gas, right? You guys probably can't either. Be the cut block that leads down to our jerry cans, and then that'd be pretty much it for the day. <laughs> it's so early, but all the players are out of fuel. I honestly have a decent amount left. Well, this is a good little tour. How much fuel you got? Low. Low. <laughs> I think I got three quarters of a tank almost. We're on our way down, but this is the groom trail right here. As you can see, it's been really busy today. Pretty much doing cow cars on the group trail. We're getting down here in elevation now, and the snow is uh, getting cocky here. Hopefully, the freezing level doesn't creep up any higher, and we'll be good. <laughs> I think it might get a little bit higher this afternoon before it goes back down. It's gonna be pouring when we get back down to the truck. Busy day in the lot. Well, 
successful day one out there. Good snow, a good time, good terrain, good guide. Thanks, Wayne, for taking us out. Wayne actually rides with uh, these guys all the time, but I think I've run with them once before. And uh, yeah, good stuff. We'll see what tomorrow brings. Not sure what the plan is, but we'll be riding. Nice romantic dinner with the boys. <laughs> Look how elegant we are. <laughs>